Morgan, you got any hair pomade? Hey, Arthur. Good to see you. Why? You want rescuing again, do you? <laughs> no. I got a plan to make it up to you. A oh, plan like the Blackwater Ferry job, or like you going off scouting and ending up in jail? <laughs> Dutch said you was a, a big shadow cast by a tiny tree. I don't even know what that means. Mm, I thought you was a tough boy. <laughs> Not one of those gentlemen. <laughs> trying to protect his riding clothes. I just know whenever things get real, you turn yellow, lose your head. Yellow? 
Sure seems that way. So I guess you won't be riding with me to rob the banking coach comes about this time in the strawberry. I heard one of the O'Driscoll boys yapping about it while I was inside. You and me? Do robbery? That's what I said, didn't I? After you. <laughs> There's a spot up this way with a good view of the trail. What are you doing anyway, camping out here like some crazy hermit? Can't exactly stay in town now, can I? Like I told you, I ain't going back to Dodge without a peace offering. So what's the deal with this coach? What do you mean? Comes through about this time every day, like I said, the end. I mean, how many men, guns, riders? Nothing serious. You'll be fine. I heard the bank's been hiring every trigger man they can get of late. The meaner, the better. You worry too much. Forgive me if I ain't wholly faithful in something an old Driscoll told you when you was half drunk in a jail cell. He kept yapping about it, saying how they've been hitting it on the regular. That's a good lead in my book. Damn old Driscolls are everywhere now. Bastards got a hold of most of Big Valley. Heard they took over some big ranch north of here. How the hell you and Lenny end up down here, anyway? Oh, you know how it is? A few loose ends, drink here, drink there. What loose ends? Nothing that needs to concern you. I always pay my share. It concerns me when you put us in danger and we don't realize till it's too late. Like that move you pulled in Strawberry. Making me kill half the town, just for your precious guns. Precious they are. You need to roll a little looser, Morgan. Looser? I've seen you come full undone more than once now, and you've only been running with us a few months. Are we gonna rob this coach or bicker about it? What's done is done. Guess we're robbing it. Then let's do it. up on this ridge. Whoa there. They should be here in a little bit. Hold tight. Which way will they be coming in? Should be from over there. We need to hit them fast before they get into town. Well, just don't lose your head this time. Of course, tough guy. <sighs> they should be here. Any minute. <clears throat> Look, there they are. Right on time. Get covered up.
keep your face covered now. It's just you and me, sweetheart. How long does it take? Next time, I'll leave you in the dust. I'm hoping there won't be a next time. <laughs> you don't mean... Yeah! Baylock! Come on, boy! Look mm. here. Find new rifle, too. Here you go, Arthur. From me to you. That's more your style than mine. What did I tell you? Like licking butter off a knife. Something like that. You don't want to just break it open here and be done with it? Could be more than we can carry. And there might be a second crew of riders tailing. All right, then. Not to mention, we ride back in with a big tank and a new wagon to boot. Judge can't say we ain't pulling our weight no more, can he? I ain't sure I trust this new act of yours one bit. Listen, I know we got off on the wrong foot, but I got no beef with you. I reckon we're a lot alike, you and me. Now, hold up there. Dutch knows I'm a feller that gets things done. Shit! Now we're being robbed! Get across the river! What the hell? Come on, Arthur! Get out of there! You dumb bastards! Dead bodies. Since when did you have a problem killing O'Driscolls? Huh, huh. You've got a point. Let's strip this coach then. It clearly ain't going nowhere now. You know, we should really pick up a lock breaker one of these days. Save ourselves some bullets. Yeah, because saving bullets is such a concern of yours. Let's take what we can and get the hell out of here. That lock should shoot off easy enough. I'll give you the honors. On account of, well, this little mess. You shooting it or not? Go on then. Done wasting my breath on you. <laughs> that should do it. Come on, let's see if all this was worth All I see is you, me, a river full of dead O'Driscolls, and a lockbox. I'd say we're golden here, Morgan. Look at that. <laughs> What's the cut here? It's good. Just make sure the gang gets its peace. Yeah, yeah. Like I said, Big shadow, tiny tree. And like I said, that still don't mean nothing. Get out of here. Go see Dutch. 
Make sure you ain't followed. I know, boss. I know. It's been fun!
Well, at least it ain't your job. Ah, shut up, Arthur. Yeah, your job's starting the fights. You ain't winning them. I can scrap, Arthur. I'm just not good at homework. I can see. Besides, what do you care, Englishman? You've got no time for me. I tried to find your work, but then you're off cutting jobs with other folks, and your boy Sean doesn't get a look in. Guess I don't want to get shot, that's all. Yeah, you're a real fucking funny shit, Arthur Morgan, huh? Real fucking funny. Calm down. You better sleep with your eyes open. Yeah, well, you're gonna sleep with your chest open if you ain't careful, boy. <laughs> I love you, Arthur Morgan. I love you. Come on, take a shot. Come on, take your best shot, please, eh? Grow up. Hey, let me come on the raid, witches. Raid? Don't be playing coy with me, son. It's unbecoming. That bloody train you and him has set up. What you're doing out here, you're going to need guns. You're going to need men. Oh, that. So Marston told you? It ain't a big show. I need calmness. If I take you, I might as well bring Micah along. Now compare me to that oily toward again. You're a dead man. <laughs> Fair enough. Anyway, Arthur, what's your problem with me? In fact, don't tell me. I already know. You are threatened by me. Threatened by you? Yeah, my youthful vigor. It intimidates you. Does it? It's a story as old as the hills. The changing of the guards, the fading of the light. You're toast, old man. Okay. <laughs> And where are you? Well, in the future. In all its glory. Oh, well, good luck. Good luck and shut up. <laughs> I want to get some rest before nightfall. <clears throat> Wake up, you lazy sir. Oh, what are you doing here, kid? I'm coming, John. On the job. I said you weren't coming. Yeah, well, Arthur says I am. And it's his party, boy, so come on, let's go. <laughs> Me and the big cheeses, love it. Can't wait to slit some bastard's throat. You sure about this? No. <laughs> Are we ready? Yeah. Train's due through tonight. All right, then. It's on. Charles? I'm ready. Gentlemen, let's go earn some money. Hey, all the horses untethered? Think so. Good. They should follow on behind us. Stay on the damn road! You find a good spot, Wolfman? Yeah. Follow the trail southwest. There's a spot that's remote, but should still give them enough time to spot the oil wagon. They see this block in the tracks, they'll stop soon enough. Apparently, picks up a new team of cars at the state line, so... Shouldn't be too much in the way of guns to deal with. See, this is what I mean. I disappear for a couple of weeks and you cut me out of all the action. Just the action that requires a brain. Ha ha ha. You're a funny fella, John Marston. But my folks, eh? You had your feet up the whole time, playing sick, and fondling that new scar like you're gonna buy a breakfast in the morning. You don't know what you're talking about. Stay close on this. Wouldn't want you getting scratched by a squirrel or something. That could put you out of commission for the rest of the year. Why do you have to speak so much? It's incessant. Because I've still got some blood in me veins. You old bastards have forgotten how to live. They're left here, towards Rhodes. I blame you two for rescuing them. Far too much trouble for what we got out of it. Yeah, takes a whole army of bounty hunters to bring in Sean McGuire. And look at me now. In the gunner's sea, <laughs> back in business, boys. <laughs> you know, my dad always used to say... Not the dad, no, please. Not this oh. again. Fine. Damn you three. Sulky, angry, scarface. A right barrel of laughs. Yeah. So, we knocked the tracks with the wagon, then jumping. That's the plan. Pretty much. Charles, we can deal with the engineer. John, secure the passenger car fast. Take charitable donations and make sure everyone behaves. Little Mr. McGuire, you focus on the baggage car. Grab any valuables you can find. Shoot your mouth, get a bullet back. So, what are you doing? I'll run point. Keep an eye out for outriders and the law. Here's good. Stop the wagon over the tracks. Remember, these are innocent folks. We handle this right, nobody needs to die here.
Mr. Marsh, Mr. Smith, Mr. McGuire, come! Get over there. When she slows, order. And you? I'm gonna make sure she slows. I still want to die with you. <laughs> I like it. Get moving. I'm going aboard. Make that quick and join us on there. All right, get on that train. Hey. Faster. All yours, Captain. We'll go on ahead. Ah! Everybody stay calm. Shut up. You get shot. Go. Everything you got. Money, valuable. There you go. Let's make this quick, people. Come on. So this is we unnecessary. This please. please, please. Empty your don't pockets, mister. I ain't got nothing. Way. Wanna have a little chat with Romeo and Juliet here? This is unnecessary. Get no, no, dying over. Get everything Tell him, you got. What's the problem here? This is unnecessary. Please. Money. Oh. Hey. Don't hey. do this. Just give it to him, Thomas, please. Okay. Come on. Okay. In the bag, God everything you got. Keep it coming, don't Maybe be shy. People like you, you make me sick. You two seem to think we're playing games. I want to count to three. God damn it. Oh, God. Sick is better than dead, lady. And I'm losing my goddamn patience. Let's just do what he says so this can be. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a robber. You want to make this quick? No. You go ahead and look for the baggage car. Reach out. Tough guy, huh? You sure about Why that? Why are we wasting our time? You huh? show this son of a bitch we ain't Quick, around on. here. Everything you got. Money, valuables. We ain't leaving until this bag's full. You won't get a damn cent from me. Let me hand you over to my friend then. Don't. Money now! Son of a bitch. Come on, cuff it up, people. Don't be shy. Everything you got. Let's go. What did you say? Huh? I'm on you. Please. I'm not a bad man. I can handle this from here. You should check on Sean. Okay. What was that, huh? You're gonna need oh, all your money, my friend. None of you got a big muscle. What is it? You alright? Build the baggage car. For Christ's sake, you ain't even taking a look yet? There's probably something in here, Arthur. Twice a chance of hitting someone. <laughs> Very funny. We're looking good in here. Oh, oh. I'm gonna have a right old lump on me head. At least you ain't got a hole in it. Are those tennis rackets in there? Posh bastards. Just keep your eyes peeled. I'm doing me best, all right? I know, that's what's worrying me. These folks are rich, all right. All right, we should probably be going now. Come on, we should get out of here. Some decent stuff. We'll 
Take that. Got a problem? There's two arseholes on horses. How many you say? I just see a pair of them. Uh, in that case, we're fighting. Horst Smith, get ready. You men come out the train now, do you hear? We said you men come out now. There's only two of you, you fools. We got a whole lot less to lose. Why don't the two of you ride away? That way, neither of you getting killed. Goddamn liberties. Eh? There's a few more of them torn enough. <laughs> Damn my big mouth. Okay, let's deal with them. We won't tell you again. Look at what the left here from the friends! That was fun, boys. Real fun. We can see what they call you the professionals in the outfit. Shut <laughs> up. At least we made some money. Now, what did I get? Gotta be a hundred dollars here. Very nice. You weren't even invited. <laughs> what now? <laughs> we still need a real big take. Enough for us to get out of here. Was that a setup? Law turned up real fast. I don't know. I don't think so, but I'm starting to get nervous. Think they followed us from Blackwater? Maybe. They found me already near Horseshoe, but I think this law was just locals. I hope so. I'm gonna head into Valentine, see if I can get something started there. Good idea. Either way, we should all go it alone right now. You know the deal. Don't be followed. Uh, of course not, boss. Yeah. Whoa! Yeah! Morning. Broke game planted on you.
Yeah. 